How to create a new contact profile card on the Samsung Galaxy S25 series. First tap on the home button to return back to the home screen. Now on the home screen, swipe up to go into the app screen. In here, tap on the contacts app. Next, to create a new contact, go to the top here and tap on the add button. Then in here, you can choose where to save your contact to. You can save it to your Samsung account, save it to your local phone storage, or you can save it to your Google account. So in my case, I'm going to save it to my phone. Then you can give it a name. So here, tap on the arrow button to expand the name text field. In here, you can use name prefix, or just first name, middle name, last name. Here, I will name it Bob. And then Jen. Okay, so Bob Jen. And then uh, if we have a name prefix, you can put it in there. Otherwise, uh, you can leave it empty. Next, we put in the phone number. So I'll put in the phone number 12345618910 or 0. So just a demo phone number, not a real phone number. And then if you wanted to add in any, any other phone number, you can do so. Tap on Add Phone Number to add in home phone number or additional. Phone number so here if you tap on the drop down you can select the type of phone number it is so here we can choose mobile home work work fax home fax pager and other um, call type so here i can choose my work phone or my mobile and then if i go down here i can choose home so home can be nine eight seven six five four three two one and then tap on email if that contact has an email and if you'd like to add in the details, you can do so. So here, David at itjangles.com. Okay, so we put in the email address. You can add in any other email address if you wanted to. Then here, you can assign it to a group. So if this is a, a work contact, you can choose coworkers. Uh, by default, it is set to not assigned. And here you can choose coworkers in any other group that you want. You can even create a new group if needs be. So here I will choose IT Junkers group and then tap on the back key. And then tap on view more. So after that you can scroll down. In here you can fill in the work info such as job title. So job title. Department. So here uh, marketing. Company into jingles. And then you can uh, put in the address, uh, any important date such as birthday, anniversary, other, or custom date. So put in a date and then tap on done. Uh, relationships. So what is your relationship with this contact? You can uh, put in, uh, tap on the drop down to choose a relationship with this contact. So it can be uh, mother, father, brother, and so on. So here we can choose manager. And then if you have any other relationships, you can add in. Finally, you can tap on notes and website. So you can add in any notes for this particular contact. Uh, so for example, please only call home number after five. PM. Okay, so we add in a note and then tap on save. And that's it. So we have now successfully uh, added in a or created a new contact uh, profile card. At the top here is a profile picture icon. You can tap on that to add in a picture. So tap on the edit button. And here you can choose uh, an image uh, from the gallery here. You can tap on the add button to select a different image. You can also choose the real actual image from the camera. So tap on camera and then choose while using the app. So while using the app, we can use the camera to take a picture. So here you take a picture of the actual contact. And because I don't have a contact right now, so I'm just going to capture this uh, AirPods. Okay, so you can move your selection box around. You can also zoom in or zoom out like that. And then tap on done. Okay, so you can use that. You can also delete the image and then choose gallery. So you can select uh, one from the gallery. 
and then tap on done. And then tap on saved. Okay, so now we have added a image or a picture to the context uh, profile. And then tap on back here and that's it. So here we have now successfully created a context with a profile picture. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel for my videos.